The secret is gravity clean technology. Supposedly this tank cleans itself. This is gonna be awesome. What is going on, Krills? Welcome back to another video here. Today, I've got this fish tank right here, as seen on TV. This tiny little fish tank. As you know, we've done a few of these in the past, making like world's smallest fish tanks. And this one I actually bought off Amazon. This tank was online. It was only like $9. And I got it off Amazon. This is not a sponsor, not for Amazon, not for this tank right here. I'm actually going to review this tank and see if it's good or not. If you're new here, this is going to be an interesting video to find me on because, uh, I don't know if this is gonna work or not. The secret is gravity clean technology. Oh gosh. My fun fish cleaning tank. Hey Bubba. Ages eight to 100 plus. Okay, so if you're seven, you can't have this aquarium. You're just not allowed. There's the front image. It's a girl like pouring water into the tank and then it's like taking out the dirty water. You see that? Clean water in, dirty water out. The secret is gravity clean technology. On the side here, what we got going on is watch your fun tank light up. So there's a light that actually goes in the top. That'll be pretty cool. Captivate your family's imagination with an incredible water world. Cleans itself like magic. What? All right, and on to the, I, th I believe this might be the front. I don't know, one of the two are the front. The aquarium that cleans itself. Risky to be putting on front of one of your product boxes because you're pretty much telling the customer this is gonna clean itself So I'm gonna put dirty water in we're gonna do a bunch of little experiments And then maybe if it's uh if it does turn out good We'll get a little tiny fish for it. Maybe like a minnow or something not a betta fish Don't put a betta fish in one of these tiny little aquariums for those of you who want the dimensions of this fish tank There they are right at the top right there. Here's what this box does include my fun fish half gallon aquarium, one white LED light, river bend stones, so it's gonna come with a few stones, one aquatic plant, and that's that right there. So I don't know if the rocks are real or fake, I have no idea, there's the LED light, there's the plant, there's the rocks, there's the aquarium. I am going to pop this box open. I'm actually very, very curious. This isn't a typical video for me. I purchased this on Amazon specifically to make a video just like this. Oh, those might be real rocks. That, that's heavy, those are real rocks. So far, doesn't look too shabby, but I don't know about that clean water stuff. They're very curious animals. They're just gonna be chilling, like, wondering what I'm doing this whole time. All right, so let's lay out all the stuff that it comes with. So here is the aquarium. Let me pop it out of the bag there. Of course, plastic, not glass. Here's some sort of we're gonna figure out all those. This aquarium's actually straight up, which is not something I've ever seen before, if I'm not mistaken. Okay, so here's all the products. Bag of real rock, so it is real rock, and it, they made it where it literally, like, they're still in the bag, but it just covers the bottom of the aquarium. Hey, it works, it works, it's a good sign. Oh, maybe not. There's the top. All right, this, this is gonna be cool. All right, directions are key here. There's that, I'm gonna place it just like they have it. Assembly instructions, step one, pull the tube and I figured garbage instructions, but pretty self-explanatory on the box here. This tube actually is going to sit on the very bottom of the aquarium. I'm guessing that's what's gonna suck up the dirty water, which is pretty smart. This little piece right here is gonna be the first thing we put in. The big side is what we're gonna plug this tube into, as you can see right there. We're gonna make this side go down and this side have the up curve. That way, so when it's in the tank, I could pop it through the white hole right here and then you're gonna have that curve right at the bottom of the aquarium. As you can see, looks nice. Cleaning out the gravel, just like this. All right. Perfect amount. Looking good. Now this plastic plant, we're gonna rinse this off as well. All right, and there is our plant. Now on the end here, there's this little tiny piece that's gonna pop right into the smaller side of the other one and act as if it's like an overflow system. That sun is so bright. Anyway, we're back out here at the new pond. According to that fish tank, it's gonna take the dirty water out with that system. In this case, in the skimmers of my pond, there is an overflow. As you can see, in the skimmer is an overflow. If the water gets up to that point right there, it'll just start going into there and then run out a pipe back there. I thought I'd come outside and show you guys that because it's pretty similar. Now outside, and I've got the hose here, and I'm very curious to see what they mean by a clean dirty water out so I'm gonna get a just a chunk of dirt you know kind of kind of do this dirt will settle to the bottom like right here this is the old turtle enclosure before I moved him into a bigger spot but a lot of dirt is on the bottom and look how crystal clear the water is there's actually goldfish in here too they're hiding under that rock right there so dirt will settle and it'll almost just become another substrate so you can see how dirty the water is right now just because I just put that dirt in it's definitely a little foggy and I want to see what they'll do but that's what I was talking about dirt is literally just another substrate Dude, it's, it's working. It's working. What the heck? I don't get how that works. It's crystal clear. I never in a million years would have thought that fish tank would actually work and get the water clear. One sec, just a little more. 
Let's see. Ready? Look at all that dirt. So whatever this white piece right here is, that right there is exactly what's making the water clean. That is crazy. It's already clear after I just put the dirt in like that. Now that I've taken the hose out, I want to see. It's going to drain like all the water, isn't it? You're going to have to have water flowing. Dang, dude, this is crazy. So to be honest, I really don't get the point of all this stuff right here I'm not I'm not exactly sure they weren't kidding when they said the aquarium cleans itself you just fill it up with water it goes through that tube that's all the way at the bottom of the tank takes the dirty water and pushes it all out that's incredible I'm gonna add the lid on right now so there's that it actually doesn't look too bad Jerry what are your thoughts I like the light you got it there we go so now the LED light is on and look at that let's turn the lights off in here it actually doesn't look bad at all crystal clear water the LED's bright it ain't cheap I think I'm going to the pet store and I'm gonna get one feeder minnow just one I'm gonna say hey can I have one feeder minnow they're like this big microscopic but I'm not gonna feed that to the fish I'm actually gonna put them into the turtle pond where he'll grow up and have a good life I'm gonna put beneficial bacteria in here and as well as dechlorinator and then we'll be set ah oh. <laughs> so, pet store, here I come. I'm getting one minnow. One sword tail. That was in the, sometimes the sword tails get mixed up with the feeders, right? Yeah. Scrimp? Oh yeah. Shrimp. So we got one little ghost shrimp and then a little feeder fish that was in here. Well, I'm gonna put it in the mini punk. That fella right there. See the little sword off his tail? Bought a new filter for George's tank. The other one was kind of just dying out on me, so I bought another one. So we got our fish and our new filter. There we go. There's our sword tail. All we gotta do is acclimate this fish to this little fish tank. Oh, there's gonna be water everywhere. Oh, I don't even know why I did it. I don't even know, mom, I hope. Um, you know, people are gonna probably be saying, why don't you just stop the water from coming out right now, but there's really just no point. It's already enough water on the carpet. You might as well just keep letting it go. It's just water, it's just water. You can do that though, and that'll stop it. Right there, I've got an arrow pointing to it just in case you can't see it, but both the shrimp and the fish are chilling right there. And uh, the only thing that I'm curious on how you can even keep a fish in here is there's not really filtration. Although it does keep the water clean, there's no oxygen. It's just a cup of water, pretty much. So for long term, I, I wouldn't keep anything in here. But let me just show you. So for those of you who might want to buy this for yourself and keep fishing it, I don't suggest it. There's many other fish aquariums you could buy than this. Uh, at local pet stores. So I highly suggest maybe going to a pet store, maybe getting a five gallon tank. Something like that right there. Z, that's 10 gallons. But this is really cool for a little review on a product as seen on TV. My final review, one out of 10. I'm very impressed that it actually did keep the water clear when it said cleans itself like magic. What? I'm gonna give it a six out of 10. It did what I didn't expect it to do. Um, but for those of you, once again, I, I wouldn't suggest this for fish long term in this aquarium. Look at how beautiful that fish is right there. Go free with all your other buddies. Woo! Long lasting life because that fish right there will breed with all of these fish. He'll have a great life. Hey, and that goes for our shrimp as well. Check this out, ready? So long, scrimper. The new goldfish, all the mollies, platies, everything's looking good. If you haven't done so already, I highly suggest joining the family, hitting the subscribe button, checking out more of these videos because we got a lot on this channel about this backyard. But I wanted all you guys to know, I just bought a house. So we ended up going through with that house that I showed you guys recently. I wasn't going to mention this, but I want to let everyone know that we're going to have so much content to come. And if you haven't done so already, just click the subscribe button down below. It's free. Today's positive comment shout out goes out to Aiden Smith. Love your videos. Appreciate that, Aiden. And to everyone for the support down in the comments below, if you want to win a positive comment, shout out and have your comment in one of these upcoming videos, all you got to do is comment something positive down below and hit that like button.